Does anybody need a hat? Because we found one here in Anne McKinley's parking lot. Welcome back to your Daily Dose, everybody. One last day with Casey's uh, fam bam. Hopefully the Packers won. Filming this on Saturday. You guys will I think see this on Monday. So hopefully the Packers season has not come to an end. I do have their umbrella uh, right now. Go Pack Go. Hey baby. Hi. Having fun with your fam? Yeah, it's on. Oh. We're live. It's like We're live. Place. I'm having so much fun. I always go so, when Savannah comes. And I'm really happy my aunt is here too. We're yes. Having a great weekend. It's a girls weekend plus Kyle. <laughs> and we're here for it. It's fine. That's how how it rolled growing up sometimes. Looks like we still have Christmas here, but we do have a rainy day. And the fun thing is the crowds are not an animal kingdom. Everything's walk-ons besides Pandora. And in we go. Christmas tree is still up. Next couple days should be down. I guess we'll see. I don't know. Maybe by Monday when you guys see this, it'll be down. But look at the light crowds. Rain makes the crowds go away. Even on a run Disney weekend. Unfortunate too, they had to cancel like the half marathon. They weren't running, well they didn't cancel it, but they weren't running exactly a marathon into Magic Kingdom, which is a little bit disappointing, but at least they didn't cancel the whole race, so. Completely, completely empty at the touch points. All right, Case, what's the sitch? Because it's raining out, and that's a, that's a good thing for, for Disney crowds. It's a great thing today. I was expecting the park to be really busy starting off, especially Animal Kingdom. So I feel like a lot of people will like hit Animal Kingdom first, and then park out. But it's actually pretty empty today. The rain is on our side. Rain is always on the side at yes. Disney. Always. We're lucky, even though it's a little wet. That's okay, we're prepared. And we're going to have a good day. Yay! Yay! Savannah, how do you feel? I feel so happy. <laughs> <laughs> we love her. It's very simple. Rain makes the crowd go away. Also, look at Casey's cute rain jacket. What a guy. We got this at the park just like years ago, and it comes in clutch every single time it rains here. That's my girl. That's my girl. What a cutie. I think we're gonna make our way over to Safari's, but first get some Starbucks. Fun fact, I did not sleep at all last night. Like I got up at five and did not sleep, so I kind of started planning out a lot of vlogs in the future, future. Got a lot of work done, which was really, really, it's gonna benefit us for sure. But this is crazy. Just a big difference. Just a big difference here. So Savannah, we did, the last time she was here, we didn't come here. So we're like, sniff which way <laughs> Starbucks is. And she guessed right. And that's because I'm a natural girl in her Starbucks habitat. So. Uh-huh. That only makes sense. It's just my natural Starbucks instincts. To go... They kicked in. Except, now that we're in Animal Kingdom. We are here. Yeah. I said she guessed right, but we actually went left. But it was technically <laughs> right. You know what I mean? <laughs> I was thinking, I was like, wait, she guessed right. But it was technically left, but it was right. Yeah, but like... Yeah, you guessed right, right being left. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> there is like nobody in Starbucks today. Got a, I wouldn't say a dry day, but we have a dry park day for crowd-wise. Of course, the girls are looking at the mugs. This is kind of weird that they're selling an Ariandel mug here in Animal Kingdom. You think this would be at like Epcot? This has been here for uh, the holidays, but I don't think I actually showed you guys. Casey wants it, but it's a really cool one. It's so funny because Casey, when Savannah's in town, Casey always, always, always goes on shopping sprees. It's so funny. Savannah's good influence. Really no, she's, she's a really bad influence. No, she's a good influence. <laughs> well, a good influence on me, like, personally. To be fair, she influenced me to buy my Gucci bag and I'm still recovering three years later. <laughs> I think Starbucks has Valentine's Day cake pops already. It looks like it. What does that mean? Certain January, it's uh, already Valentine's Day. Here's what we're working with as far as the wait times. The whole park is a walk-on besides flight. And if you're here like last weekend, it was a zoo. But we're doing good, we're doing good. This is awesome. Come in the rain, y'all. Everyone who's been subscribed knows, knows the drill. Those of you who are new, well now you know. Now you know. Food is delivered. Well, it was difficult to find cover, so we came over in the Harambe marketplace. But actually we have a huge update with future sitting situation. It's just gonna be more sitting, but they actually broke through on the other side of the wall here. I wanna take you guys over here. I'm kinda of thinking maybe in a month or less than a month this is gonna open. Just right on over here, they actually have an entranceway over 
to this new seating area, you can see that they're molding it out with like the steel. Didn't know that was gonna do that, but it makes sense. Nice little passageway for more Tamu Tamu seating, which is what this area is. Now it's gonna extend over in that building when hopefully that opens up in a month or so. Could be sometime January. Still Christmas music here too. Jingle bells. Real quick side note as I was just kind of stumbling upon this area, there's a hidden Mickey right here. Right in front of Tamu Tamu. Right here. It's a cool one. Stopping a little bit with the rain, so we might be good because I think it's supposed to clear up for the rest of the day. Um, at least that's what meteorologist Savannah has told us. By noon, the rain's gone. We've got a little drip drip here, but <laughs> it's going to be gone soon. Magical day. Five minutes for safaris. Some, personally, some of my best safaris have been when it's raining out, so I'm happy Savannah and her mom get to experience a uh, kind of a rain safari because the animals come out. It's cooler out, but it's kind of like done raining, so that you, we'll see how it is, but usually it's going to be good. But it's a five minute wait, so that means it's a what? It's a walk on! <laughs> Casey, what is it? It's a walk on. <laughs> Clearly, I'm the boring cousin. No, you're not. Yes, I am. Compared to her, like she said last time, only one of us could have the spotlight gene, and it was definitely not me. <laughs> they only have one side open today. Maybe if it gets busier, they'll open that, but they probably have sent a lot of people home. It's not needed today. I'm just here to document the moments. <laughs> <laughs> Guys, he just said, I think Twin Day, which means let's go in Swahili. I'm gonna start saying that all the time. I think that's Please keep those hands, arms, feet, and legs inside the truck at all time. If you look above your head, you'll see that animal spotting guide, which helps keep reference of some of the animals we have here at the Harambe Wildlife Reserve. Twin Day. And just another reminder, we're gonna be entering into yeah. these animals' homes today. So please be respectful. Do not call out to the animals. Yell at the animals, whistle at the animals, or make his signals Simba. at the animals that will tend to. And to our right hand side, there is going to be the okapi antelope. The okapi there may look like it's related to the zebra, but they're going to be giraffe. more commonly related to the giraffe. I knew it. They're currently oh, wow. the only known relative to the giraffes, and they'll have a long black bluish tongue, four yeah, stomachs, they only just have like one cows relative. and giraffes, and two ossicles. Well, the males will. Never and seen the up there. They also tend to live in tiny little pots of around well, three like to deer. ten. A fully grown greater kudu will grow up to around five feet tall, and they'll be them. We're now leaving the forest and making our way toward the rivers of Africa called the Sun. And instead of sweating, they will ruffle their feathers and flap their wings to help pull off their internal body temperature. They'll get their pinkish color during mating seasons, and once they do find a mate, they will go off and mate for life. Hand side of the truck in that little The right side of the truck was not a good choice today. So much actually on the left. In a fight or flight situation, they will usually tend to choose fight. They'll use their long curved horns to help block ledges and incoming attacks from incoming predators. Or they're likely sleeping while they are standing up, so they're always wide alert in case a predator may be lurking a little too closely nearby for them. 100,000 to 1.5 million at a time. You gotta when wait. they migrate, they're able to kick up so much dust in the wow, air the that all that dust are so close. Like see from up in the yeah, one in the way right now. Jeez, you're trying to call the wildebeest out of the way. <laughs> wildebeest roadblock. There he goes. <laughs> Shape up their ears. Oh my goodness! Look how close the elephant is. Of Africa. They're never down here. Have you seen elephant flapping their ears? That means they're trying to cooperate. What a great safari. They have blood veins that run throughout their entire earlobe, and by flapping their ears, they can help circulate mm. that blood. Nose. Here's a rhino. White rhinos will weigh around 5,000 pounds and have very poor vision. They will see up to 10 feet in front of them, so oh. whether it be a human or eight per hour. Got a pretty good look at the ostriches. They'll use their large wings that they have here. to help guide themselves in whichever direction they the want rhino. to be running in. So if an ostrich wants to turn left, they'll end up putting out their left wing to help guide them in that specific direction for them. Casey and I thought it was a what's up. Oh, I don't know. Should we go to the Gorilla Falls? Or do we, or do we skip it? Do we want to see gorillas? I mean, we got zoos and homes. Okay. <laughs> Savannah, we were gonna. We, we thought it was a good, a good little safari. What do you, What do you think? I think it was a great safari. Um, 
better than what I could get at home in Chicago um, until I can get to Africa. Um, favorite part? Go well. Go wild. How do you say the word? Swahili. Oh no, shoot that. <laughs> Twin day. Let's go. Let's go. Why did I say Swahili? Anyways, onwards. Whoa, I never know how. That's a. Yeah, go go model it, Casey. Okay, go show us. Yes. Yes, Casey. So good. All right, guys, for the record, these are Christmas decorations. Right, Casey? Yes, they are. I think. Yep, they're going to be down soon. This is crazy. 10 minute wait for Mickey Mouse? We're going to go do it. <laughs> Twins! I've actually never been in here. First time in this room. There's really not that much of a queue. If this is all there is. I'm going to love it like this. Mr. Right in the jungle. <laughs> it is cute. And then we got this one over here as well. Them admiring Everest. This picture frame is actually broken. I don't know how long it's been broken for, but it's actually out of the frame. It's kind of, look at this. That is not safe. Hopefully they fix that. And here we go. I think, oh, there's more of a queue. I've never been in here before. This is the next room. So there's a queue after the queue, but this is like after merge. Forgot that they got rid of photo pass and you uh, get your picture from the machine here. I'm gonna paint my hands, I'm so excited. You got this, you got this. I'm nervous. It's Savannah's day, here we go. <laughs> Mickey and Minnie are both here. Hey Mick. Hey Mick. Your dream has come true. <laughs> Guys, I'm so proud of you. <laughs> Go Savannah. And you can still take pictures on your phone, by the way. There's someone here to do it for us. But yeah, never been in here before. Yeah, of course. Should I tell them who's number one? Yes. Hello. Hi. Good to see ya. Good to see ya. I know, you look so good. I like those portraits that you have out there. You know? So cool. It really is. Oh, you want? Okay, okay. I'll come in the picture. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, let's do it. The girls are up. Side note, they've got a, a map of all their travels over here. <laughs> look at two stars. I know, you guys are two stars. <laughs> he knows how to work it for the camera, too. We're just like each other. <laughs> <laughs> I love that. I love that. That was a good idea. Thanks, man. I, I don't want to make Mickey jealous, though. He's not going to be jealous? No? Okay. All right. You look great. Thank you so much. <laughs> Hi, everyone. It's so good to see you again. We're here in Animal Kingdom. We just met Benny and Mickey, and I can't even remember the last time I got to see a character, so that was so exciting. I almost cried real tears, like real happy tears. Maybe, um... A little dramatic, but that's just me. Middle name, drama. So, um, no surprise there. But it was raining this morning and the sun came out. So, how perfect. <laughs> you're just so good. Oh, shoot, I wasn't recording. No, you're kidding. That <laughs> yeah, was I'm so kidding. good. Oh my God, that was so good. Well, the day has cleared. We got blue skies now. So much for the umbrellas. That was a quick shower. How nice. Check this out too. Now everybody's here. We're trying to make the, the Lion King show, but we didn't really anticipate this many people being here right now. Y'all, it's been a long time since we've seen this show. We're heading on in for the, uh, what, what show is this? One o'clock, one o'clock, right? Um, one yeah. o'clock, yeah. Not too many people are lined up for this show. I wonder if they're still eating lunch, but this is a, uh, Pretty nice for us. By the way, they start letting in about 15, 10 minutes early for the standby queue. And we're back on in. We're about like 12 rows deep, but we got an end, so it should be pretty good. There's also like nobody behind us. We got an empty show today. I mean, the crowds are just starting to get here today, uh, today as you guys saw. 
All right, let's enjoy the show.
having you with us. You are a lovely group, the best audience ever. Now, please, get out! You know this film, ten for first of belongings, ten small children by the hand, yada yada yada, moving an orderly... Oh dear, it's sunny and, and bright out now. Um, I don't know how much of that made it because of copyright. I might have put a song over it just to show you guys because we haven't seen that in forever. You enjoy? Very good show. Yeah. I had a little bit of anxiety with the, um, the acrobatics. Oh, yeah? But, like, couldn't be me, but I'm happy for that. It and they did you. a great job. You could do it. You a could great do it. job. Um, I'm a little clumsy. So, probably wouldn't be the best job for me, but I could be. One of the singers. You could. You could. could. You could. Yeah. She practices in church every Sunday. And in my shower. Full Disney day here. We're going to get some Satuli Canteen, but I can't get over the weather. Love it. Just put the mobile order in. Can pick it up right now. We got a lot. I guess this might be a mukbang after all. And in we go. Hopefully they have enough spots inside. They're actually getting margaritas outside right now. Ooh, Satuli. Aya caramba at all of our food here. We got a lot. Like, a lot. This is a mukbang just like Pecos Bills the other day. Oh, boy. So I got some smoked chimichurri braised beef. This is the mousse. It's one of their new uh, desserts, but they kind of I think they had it last year when we were here for the event. And I also got the hot dog with chips because we, we have to try the hot dog, right? Gotta have the hot dog. The, oh, you got it? Let's go. It's and so good. Fun fact, I've never had boba before, and I don't think I'm gonna be addicted. It's so good. <laughs> well, let's divulge. This is one of the best hot dogs on property. It's on the kids' menu. You can order it. It's really good. You will not be disappointed. Trust me, it's so good. I'm sharing it, but I wish I could eat it all by myself. I got the noodle shrimp bowl. I feel so fancy with shrimp at Disney World. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> we should have like my napkin and like <laughs> so proper. <laughs> Let's go to Victorian Alberts. We should take her to Victorian Alberts. <laughs> Ooh, it's harder than I thought. There it goes. There's the moose. Ooh. Look at that. Wow. That was the longest I think I've ever spent in Satuli. We were kind of there just chatting forever and, you know, doing family things. That was awesome. That's all I gotta say. I feel full and I feel happy and I'm uh, very pleasantly surprised with Animal Kingdom, to be honest. I don't remember anything from this park except a bug's life. So, um,. To know that there's more here than just a bug's life, because bugs are a little creepy, um, <laughs> makes me feel really good. <laughs> Drum roll, please. Jingle bells, jingle bells. Jingle all the way. You know, this collection's been out since we've been at Disneyland, but I haven't ever seen these, like, bookends. The 100th bookends. The price is actually crossed out. I don't know what it is, but I've never seen this. I, I don't remember because maybe it's sold out. This is the first box I've ever seen in the store. Casey just found a, uh, another thing for Valentine's Day. We only saw one thing today. It was in Starbucks, but got Mickey and Minnie. How much is it? 34, I'm guessing. It's no price. How do you think today's gone? Today has been so much fun. It has just been like a nice, fun day with my family. If she couldn't get anything more brown, she always is gravitating to brown. <laughs> I did see they had um, matching sweatpants to this, but I guess those are sold out. And look! It is cute. Oh, they have a hat? <gasps> Case, you, you have to get that for that whole outfit. The beanie? Yeah! No, I don't need it. I don't need it. I'm no, not to it. match this outfit, the beanie. Look it's at this. Wait, well, I mean, I this. wow, that's cute. I, I know, but. I just bought this yesterday from the parks. Aww. That's cool. Aww. Uh huh. Woo! 
and out we go. Goodbye Christmas, Animal Kingdom. Oh, we're in the golf shop at Saratoga. This kind of makes me want to become a golfer. You are a golfer. You're a mini, a mini golfer. golfer. Ah, ah, actually, oh my gosh, you're right. I could buy stuff for mini golf. You could. Shop away. <laughs> I love mini golf. Just learning that actually they have some new shirts here. This is brand new. How much are they? Uh, 94 bucks. Brand new this morning. So if you guys want some golf shirts, they have a lot of new merch. And then all of these designs are new as well. So that's nice. They got a new collection. You got to get that. Wait, look at that. And we can watch Barbie after? Yes. <laughs> Only if you get the matching pink outfit. Yeah, okay, sure. I'll be Ken. <laughs> what if we golf with, like, I, I wore pink too. We come in a pro shop and I end up buying something. I don't have anything cold weather to golf, so I decided to get this. And now I can go golfing again because I haven't gone golfing because it's been too cold. So I haven't had any athleisure like this. But we're good now. This should keep me warm. Well, everybody, just came back home to edit this video. Weird change here. I have to go run to Hollywood Studios right now. I'm gonna go meet them there, all off camera, but I hope you guys enjoyed this one. This is the last one with Casey and her family here, but um, to the next video, which is gonna be tomorrow, which is gonna be the first one with my sister in town. She's not here yet. She's actually coming to, well, she'd be here for a day when you guys see this video. So with that, I'll see you guys tomorrow, and that was it for your daily dose. It's been a, it's been a fun past couple days. Bye-bye.